So ladies and gentlemen, what you are seeing now is, uh, are the, is a mountain ridge behind the International Airport of Flagstaff. On the right side you can see the um, park and ride parking lot. It's very common in Europe. Um, I am from Belgium, my name is Mark Zandecki. And this is my first city. Um, based on the map and uh, of Sedona in Arizona, given by um, Tobaliki and some other guy that I cannot uh, recall his name again, but um, you know, it's um, something that I want to tell. Um, and well, the thing is, first things first is that my uh, LUT is corrupt and I can't reproduce the original color anymore, which is a more like a um, sandy color because it's in a, in a, in a desert. But um, as you see, I have a green color, so I'm sorry, but it's not uh, my intention. I did not intend to do this. So, um, but yes, um, it's a beautiful map. And uh, I'm going to tell you something about the city. So, uh, we have these parking rights uh, there, there, and uh, they are typically Amer uh, European because the parking right means actually that this parking lot is actually nearby a, um, a BRT bus stop or a um, a public transport uh, hub or something like that, which the international airport, uh, of course, is. So um, and now we are entering the um, Flagstaff uh, downtown area. This is actually the downtown area of uh, Sedona. It's the biggest city in, in Sedona County, but it's not a capital. Sedona City is a capital. Uh, Flagstaff has about 23, 24,000 population right now, but this, it's much more the financial um, capital of the, the, the region. And Sedona City is much more the political where the, and the juristical, uh, where the county uh, court is, where the um, county uh, hall is, I would say, uh, where the prison is. Of all kinds of facilities and administrations or um, there So take it easy, take the Greyhound, that's uh, the, the logo of the Greyhound, uh, we are entering the city, this is the second large parking lot, Did you know how many, how successful this parking lot actually is, I cannot imagine, um, it's, it's still something that I, you know, it's thrilling me, a lot of people are taking the bus, or going on foot to the city, which makes uh, driving the city much more easier and uh, much more fun. Uh, in front of you, you can see the uh, hospital area, which is actually part of the um, um, University um, of Flagstaff, because it's the University Hospital. So we are going to do some traffic jam in here. But then that's that's not a big one. You know, it's it's um, very unpleasant to see if that when you are in a traffic jam and then suddenly your car is disappearing. That's uh, very on um, you know unpleasant.
but this travel gym will not uh, will not do such things. Um, we can go further. And um, yeah, so um, what you see in, in on the left side in here is actually the central industrial um, zone of uh, central Flagstaff. And you can see uh, some. You can see also the 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 power um, that we are using is actually wind power because we have a lot of plates to do that. Well, we have one solar solar um, solar plant, but um, I think that you should use solar plants if you don't have that much of um, place or real estate. Um, for availability you know I am still thrilled about the um, about the details and, and, and the realism actually of city skylines it's it's so great So yes, so we are entering now the um, tunnel, and there is something that I can tell you about tunnels. What I did discover is that uh, there are some particular roads, and I believe the um, the four lane um, small heavy road and most of the highways expect except the uh, highway off ramps have a um, you know have a very have a very good um, build up for the tunnel system you can actually you can drive through the tunnel and you are in the tunnel. You're not in just some kind of a, a reverse simulation of the of the game. You can you can't see um, the uh, the top of uh, what what everything about what's above the ground. You can't see that, and uh, you're not floating. So um, um, you are actually really in a tunnel. So the the game the game producers uh, did. You do on some roads a good job. It didn't do it on all, and that's a shame. And it has nothing to do with the depth you are using. You can go up to thirty-six meters. It won't change. You know, it's just the type of road that you have to use. So as I said, now we are entering um, the, um, the south side of the, the south neighborhood of uh, Flagstaff, and you can see that we have a, we have in Flagstaff a very large railroad uh, yard and uh, in the rail yard, and that why that that's why we have a lot of bridges for trains and pedestrians. You can see that. This bridge is a very successful one, and um, well, you know, uh, it's it's uh, it's something that I'm, I, I'm actually proud of. That you know, it looks it looks very realistic also. And may I suggest something? If you are finished building cities, 
and you are doing a sightseeing tour and recording it, you will always accuse some traveling them. So don't even think about it to, uh, you know, to repair it. Sometimes the game repairs its traffic jams themselves, itself. So it happens. So relax. If the traffic jam is not so big, don't do anything about it. Only if it is, you know, dramatic, really. Because when you're done with your game and you have about 76-79% traffic flow, you are pretty doing well. And there always will be some flaws, uh, some flaws that that you will have um, occurring the the game. Sometimes a train just vanish vanishes uh, by, by 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 driving. Um, you know that's how it is. And now we are at night, and this is also very special about uh, the game is that you can view the nights. And that's very cool, actually. Now we are entering the town of Williams right now, and it's, we are now already doing it for 11 minutes. Um, this was the highway 17. Now we are entering actually the highway 40, but we not we are not high uh, uh, getting into the highway 40. We are getting actually into the, into the town called Williams. It's a pretty large town, about 10,000 people. And um, yes, so this is the main street of um, like your Americans are calling it, or like the British are calling it, a uh, high street, the high street of uh, William Williams. So you can see that actually Williams is built on a, on a very hilly um, in a very hilly region, and and that's something what I do like about the game that you can see the the, uh, the panoramas are actually magnificent, and I I do like the idea that you can see the the, the uh, hills far away, you know, with houses and things like that. We have a lot of apartments, of of course, also low density apartments. This is the um, Williams um, Community High School, Community High School, at the left side. And it takes you about 14 minutes to get to um, from Flagstaff to Williams, but you will be for a very long time in Williams driving because it's a it's actually a circular bus line. I do drive 
strong and for very long uh, for very um, good reason um, circular uh, bus lines in towns because I wanted I wanted people have a very good um, you know bus system and I don't know if um, linear bus lines or the uh, answer to this. Besides, people also have the uh, opportunity to walk um, through the city and I wonder what that is. That must be a star or something like that. And these are the airplanes. Or oh, this must be a new road. Okay. We do have UFOs, unidentified flying objects, and city skylines. I believe it's much well. It's much more. I, I much more likely that this is a star. Well, I've got nothing to say right now. And this is a very good view. This is the this is actually the um, uh, the street, the road where you can see the valley actually um, where um, Williams is actually lying into um, yeah, you know, it's very hilly side. Uh, so, so sometimes you can see uh, the whole street on the, to the end of the town. That, that, that's what I like about it. Yeah, people are still walking to the... Um, people are still walking to the rain. They don't care about the rain. They get wet. When the bus is ready for 10 minutes, 10 seconds. This is a magnificent view uh, over the town. Look at this, all these lights. And there seems to be no traffic at all. At least not in here. I would want to know if, if the bus stops at the bus stop where no one is. Hmm. 
there's pretty much no traffic actually. Well, right on this moment, there's nothing to to, to say actually. Um, if if it, if you were here in daylight, you would see that a lot of of these houses have a Spanish um, architecture, and that's very really, um, um, realistical because in uh, Sedona City, you have a Sedona County, Flagstaff, and then Phoenix and things like that, and Arizona. You have a lot of um, influence by Spanish architecture. And this is a magnificent view. Look at this. This, this is actually the view to, I believe, Flagstaff, actually. And this is the view to the another town, I think, for West Sedona and Sedona region. Um, very far away from here. But we are still on the west side of uh, of Williams. In Sedona City, we uh, only have our public uh, uh, our public system is actually a public transportation system is actually based on bus routes and bus routes, cabs, and um, trains, not on uh, metros or on the trams, because basically in um, so the real Sedona County, you don't have these kind of things. Now the morning is going to come. Look at this. We can see the mountains. And this is what I like about the game. The realism. Yeah, this is what I like about the game.
Ik zou mijn elektriciteitskosten hier met 2% willen gaan reduceren, maar... So this is the main street of uh, this is the main street of um, Williamstown or Williams, how do you call it? I don't know, but um, this is where all the action is, where people are living and working and buying things. So. And it's the most tropical street in the town, but as you see, um, it's too bearable. There's no, not such a thing like a traffic jam. So what else can I tell you about Williams? Uh, nothing much actually. Um, um, right now you are seeing the um, windmill park of Williams, and well, I believe we are now on the um, east side of Williamstown of Williams. I don't know how do you uh, pronounce that. I think it's Williams, just Williams.
So now we are getting actually to the, um, I think, the east side of, uh, no, it's the north side of, of Williams. And, um, well, there's nothing else we can tell about this, this site. You can still see uh, the uh, Main Street in uh, Williams, the uh, Railroad Avenue, it's called the Railroad Avenue, in the real time. So I would call it to the Railroad Avenue. It's actually the shopping street of Williams. Now I think he is going to turn right, yes, until to the um, leisure and um, resort, actually the sports uh, area of, um, of Williams, the sports and sports parks, they are all here, on the right side I believe you have a basketball court, you have a um, um, how do you call this one? Um, a skateboard park. And I believe this is the swimming pool. Swimming basin, yes, this is the basin. Swimming pool. The aquatic center, as they say. And you are entering some park areas in here, so it's a very nice place to stay when you want to rest, when you want to swim. This is a botanic garden here. On the left side you have a playground on the right side. Some park in there. People, people really can enjoy themselves in there. And this, I believe, is a soccer stadium on the left side. And you have a the, um, the worker statue. I don't know. I don't want to go. Statue of, of uh, labor. I think this is the statue of labor. And and uh, there are a lot of uh, utility cars, um, the living vans driving, not so much private vehicles, and that's very good, actually. But they are driving it here because everybody goes to work. Because this is the area where the most Williamsons, Williamsers, are working. This is the uh, industrial zone, the north, the East Williams industrial zone.
Now, you know, little fella, you're going to be killed so many times while you were standing on the street just to catch a cab. You know, I don't understand that. What just happened? Um, you have the abil ab ability to drive through the tunnel. Of course, you're not doing this. You're going to ride on the highway, where it's very dangerous to, 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 to cross the highway. And you are going like that to the um, uh, industrial zone. Pretty much something what I don't understand. There are some things that I don't understand in Sim Skylines. So now we are here at the industrial area. It's a pretty large one. No, it's a small one actually. Um, it's not a very big one. The biggest one that we have is Southwest Sedona, which you will see later on. And this is a magnificent view because further away you have the green. Um, and the main natural environment of the mountain ranges of Sedona County, and they, they are so magnificent. Look at this. And this is the view over Sedona, over Williamstown. William City, uh, I don't know how we call it. Williamstown. Maybe, I'll, maybe I will rename it into Williamstown. It sounds great. Hmm. Now there's actually nothing much to say uh, about Williams right now. Um, on the left side you have a small clinic. And well, it's much more. It's it's a very like it's a very uh, you know typical American town. With a lot of low density and sub up sprawls, but I managed to uh, concentrate them on a high street or a main street, and uh, to make sure that people are wanting to walk, I did uh, concentrate myself on on uh, uh, building um, the 
pedestrian uh, streets, pedestrian roads. So yes, um, uh, the whole area is actually actually very accessible for um, people without cars. When you're entering the evening again, we spent the whole day in um, in Williams, and now we're going to spend the evening in uh, Flagstaff again. And then we are again on the um, on the main street on the railroad avenue um, at Williams. And we are leaving Williams right now. We're going to straight to the highway to the Interstate 40. And the moon is rising right now. And this is a magnificent view over uh, Flagstaff, I believe. Um, it's a great view. Look at this. And then we have our first traffic jam. And you can see the train.
And now we're entering actually um, in the state 17, I believe. No, we're not going to go to the state 17. We're actually going to uh, directly to the city. And as you can see, I have built something. This is the North um, Flagstaff um, Junction. And what else have I tell you? This is the um, I don't know how, what kind of boulevard. This is I think this is the Burke Boulevard, the Burke Boulevard, I guess. Burke Boulevard, a, a Flagstaff City. And they all have time traffic lights in here. Yeah, I know. I have to delete that car. This is a um, a floor. This is a floor in the game. And now we are leaving uh, Flagstaff City. We are going back in the tunnel. And now we are actually into, um, we didn't really enter earlier the um, central Flagstaff um, industrial zone. What we are doing right now is just like, just that. And I think we have somewhere in here, we have a bus stop for everyone. But do, uh, do we... Are we going to, yeah, we probably we are going to stop in here somewhere. I don't remember anymore. Do we stop or not? No, we don't stop. We just go to the highway. <coughs> And now we are entering again uh, Flagstaff International. A lot of people are walking into the streets. You can see the green people, they must be aliens or something like that, I don't know. You can see blue people also. Yeah, these are the, these are the, yeah, yeah, he changed, you know, that's an alien. This old grandpa was an alien just before. 
So we do have our agents in the game. We have UFOs, just like something like this. And we have the agents. 